I just started screaming? People would cover their ears and carry on. They've seen an unhappy slave before. This port is off limits. Show your face. Nothing under this hood but an ugly old assassin. Altair, Alexander, you got my message. I assumed it was a Templar trap. Who is the woman? Templar bait. She was Robert de Saab's girl. Don't belittle me, murderer. I'm a Templar too. Unfortunately, she's a bit of a burden. We can hold her for you, Altair. We have a secure safe house. Good. I'm going to have a look around. I'll meet you there. a ghost town, hmm? People are afraid to leave their homes for fear of breaking some obscure new law. The Templars have never been interested in governing before. I wonder why now. I won't assume you're here out of charity. Can I ask your purpose? It's a complicated story, but can be summed up easily. The Templars have access to knowledge and weapons far more deadly than anyone could have imagined. I plan to change this. One such weapon is in our hands. A device with the ability to warp men's minds. If the Templars possess more like it, I want to know. And we can certainly trust the Assassins to put the Apple of Eden to better use. Where are the Templars holed up now? In Limassol Castle. But they're expanding their reach. 
And how do I get inside? Kill the captain of the castle guard. With him dead, it's likely one of our spies would be promoted to the post. And if that happens, well, you can walk right in. It's a start. Memory log updated. Find the Templar named Osman and tell him Alexander wishes his grandmother a joyous birthday. He will trust you then. Where do I find him? The Cathedral Square. He will be there soon. Osman thinks I'm coming to meet him, but you're the better man for this job. Memory log updated.
Greetings, Osman. Alexander sends his regards and wishes your grandmother a joyous birthday. Ah, the dear lady. May she rest in peace. Now, how may I help you, my friend? Can you tell me why the Templars purchased Cyprus? Was it to set up another exchequer? I don't rank high enough to know for certain, but I have heard talk of an archive of some kind. An archive? Interesting. And who is the ranking Templar in Limassol? A knight named Frederick the Red. He trained soldiers in Limassol Castle. A real brute. With the castle guard dead, what would it take to get me inside? Assuming I am appointed to his position, I could find an excuse to reduce the castle watch for a short time. Will that work? I'll make it work. Osman is making arrangements as we speak. Excellent. Now what? We give him some time. He also told me about the Templar Archive. Have you heard of such a thing? Of course. That's where we keep our undergarments. Cyprus would be a good location to safeguard both knowledge and weapons. With the right strategy, it's an easy island to defend. Ah, uh, if only our foolish Emperor had possessed such foresight. King Richard made short work of him. I'll be back soon. Memory log updated. Why does someone do that before? I haven't.
thirsty men. This is an island of superstitious heathens. Remember, they do not want you here. They do not like you. They do not understand the true wisdom of your cause. And they are scheming at every turn to cast you out. So stay on your guard and trust no one. Find the chinks in your opponent's armor and strike hard. I suggest you report him. isn't among the dead. So was she captured or set free? He's fleeing! Don't let him escape! A foul murder has shaken my order. Dear Frederick the Red, slay. Served God and the people of Cyprus with honor is paid tribute with a murderer's blade? Who among you will deliver those responsible to me? Cowards. You leave. 
gave me no choice but to flush out this killer myself. I hereby grant my men immunity until this investigation is concluded. Bouchard, the citizens are already restless. Perhaps this is not the best idea. If anyone else has objections, I invite you to step forward. Armand Bouchard! Who's that? Ah, an old colleague. Bouchard! An assassin has come to Cyprus. I managed to escape, but he cannot be far behind. Why, Maria, that would make this your second miraculous escape from the assassins, no? Once when de Saab was the target, and now here on my island. I am not in league with the assassins, Bouchard. Please, listen. De Saab was a weak-willed wretch. Verse 70 of the Founding Templar rule expressly forbids consorting with women. For it is through women that the devil weaves his strongest web. De Saab ignored this tenant and paid with his life. How dare you! Touched a nerve, did I? Lock her up! for your wrath, Maria. The Templars are your real enemy. I will kill you when I get the chance. If you get the chance. But then you'll never find the Apple of Eden. And what would Curry more favor with the Templars right now? My head or that artifact? I thought so. Despite his bravado, Bouchard obviously took Maria's warning seriously. My sources tell me that after destroying our safe house, he immediately sailed for Karenia. That's a shame. I was hoping to meet him. What's the fastest route there? By boat, definitely. But those pirates won't let you hop aboard one of their ships without good reason. Find a man named Pasha in the ports. Tell him to honor the favor he owes me, and he might be able to get you on the next ship heading north. You're a well-connected man, Alexander. Memory log updated. Alexander is calling in his favor, Pasha. He needs you to find me safe passage to Kerenia. Ah, <laughs> you must be the resistance cutthroat I've heard stories about. Chasing down Armand Bouchard, are you? Armand and his precious cargo. Cargo? Tell me more. Oh, I've just heard rumors. Holy artifacts of all kinds on these ships. For all I know, he's got the Ark of the Covenant hidden somewhere nearby. En route to the Templar Archive, no doubt. Your guess is as good as mine. As for your transport, meet me on the docks later this afternoon, and I'll see that you get safely aboard. There will be two of us. We won't be late. I'm curious about this Templar cargo. The ship's manifest might contain clues about what the Templars are bringing to their archive. I should have a look now before we set sail. Before the ship is crawling with pirates.
this manifest is a mess. A shoddy job done by lazy men. Unless this is a deliberate attempt to hide something. Sure, Captain. In search of wine and women, eh? Listen, we sail for Kyrenia in two hours. If he's not back in one, he's off this ship. Templars aren't paying me to play servant to a bunch of drunks. while you drag me onto a boat full of pirates, you're mistaken. If the pirates find you, they'll hand you over to the Templars for a handsome reward. Right back into Bouchard's hands. I wish you luck, Altair. Karenia is a rough place these days. But we have many friends in the City Watch. Look for a man named Barnabas in the Commons District. I have not heard from him for some weeks, however, so you may be on your own. Thank you, Alexander. If I return to Limassol, I will report all that I have learned. By then, we will have established ourselves a new safe house. Find us there. I struggle to make sense of the Apple of Eden, its function and purpose. But I can say with certainty that its origins are not divine. No, it is a tool. A machine of exquisite precision. What sort of men were they who brought this marvel into the world? Memory log updated. 